You know, sometimes when your straw, my straw must be messed up. I'm like sucking on the thing so hard and no water's coming out. I've been sitting in my car for probably 10 minutes and my face is still this red. Just finished Soul Cycle. That was really hard. Also, this might have been a dumb thing because uh, the IKEA is, I mean, it's not close to Soul Cycle, but Soul Cycle is kind of like in the middle between my house and IKEA. And so now I was planning to, okay, Ikea's up until 11, so it's like 7.30. I went to the 6.30 Soul Cycle class. And sorry, this lighting is so dark in here. My phone's kind of brightening my face up. Um, I was like, oh, after Soul Cycle, I'll just go to Ikea and pick up my TV stand. And then now I'm like, yeah, if I can, my arms are probably so weak. That class was like so hard for me like extra hard but I'm like oh my god the last thing I want to do is go like try to lift a tv stand but I'm just really hoping that I can lift it and that I can put it in my car I feel like I will I feel like I will I just keep telling myself that <laughs> we'll see it'll be interesting <laughs> That was so easy. I don't know if you can tell. It's pretty small. It was also in several pieces. Like, that was so easy. So, I also want to get... There is a, a white dresser that I want. And I'm going to get two of them. But I'm probably going to order one at a time. Because I'm now I'm confident that a dresser will fit in here. <laughs> I don't know. I'm like, my little Kia, like... She... Yeah, when he was, like, bringing it out... And then it was in like several pieces. I was like, oh my God. And then it was like so small. So that wasn't even hard. That was super easy. So let's see if they have the dresser in store. Um, I might place an order and I can pick it up in a couple days. Let's see. I'm happy. My Also, my thought was like, okay, worst case, if I get out, like if I bring it out to my car, because they have like curbside parking where I literally just like backed my car in and then they give it to you on a cart and I was like worst case if I either can't lift it and because I feel like they don't help you at Ikea like at Target they help you at Ikea I feel like they'd be like that, that, that is not in my job description like you know what I mean because like you go to the warehouse and get everything yourself so my thought was like worst case if it doesn't fit or I can't pick it up I'll just go back in and be like I need to return this <laughs> you know what I mean so I wasn't too worried about it but let's see if they have my dresser in stock I think they do okay add to bag basically I'm gonna get two of these white dressers and then just put them side by side because it's like a single column with four drawers they have a different one that's three rows and two columns but it's shorter i want the taller one so i'm just gonna get two of the taller ones that are only one column and just put them together I, I feel like it would look normal but i have to buy one at a time also i am pretty confident that i i know it's probably gonna be awful but i'm pretty confident that i can put the tv stand together but the dressers i'm just gonna pay a task rabbit to do it because drawers are really hard and if you mess up drawers Especially with dressers, something you open and close every day. If you mess up drawers, that would just be really annoying. Like, I I can, like, build... Like, I'm fairly competent, I think. And, um... I have, like, built... Like, I've built different things from Target. But the one thing, I'll be honest, I didn't do a good job on that I built just 100% by myself was my nightstand from Target because the drawer was, like, janky. Sometimes, like, you'd have to try a couple times to get it to open. It wasn't a big deal because I really didn't open it, like, every day. I opened it maybe a couple times a week, and it really wasn't a big deal. But, like, your dresser, you're opening, like, several times a day. That would be annoying, so... I'll probably just pay a task grab it to put it together, which I've never done before, but all right, here we go. Owner's manual. Hopefully it has instruct. Oh yeah. This is the instructions. Okay. Let's see. 
It says assemble on carpet. I don't have carpet. Two people are required when assembling heavy items. Well, that is not really an option. Okay. Okay, I might not build the whole thing, but like I can put that together. I can start doing it. I just like, I'm getting so many like packages and like all this stuff and it's like taking up a lot of room in here plus when i made dinner tonight i was like oh my gosh because i didn't want to sit on my couch i don't know if i'll ever eat on my couch i probably won't in this couch but normally i always like eat on my couch uh but this couch i probably won't ever eat on it because unless it was like popcorn or something like that but like a real dinner anything with sauce forget about it okay but if I had this put out there, I could have gone and sat out there. But, okay. Should I really do this? Uh, yeah, I'll do it. This. I'm wondering if I should assemble it outside. Like, I feel like it'll be hard for me to pick up and move. My dilemma has kind of been where I want to put this chair because my door actually opens on both sides. Like you can open it from either way. I just figured that out last night. So originally I had the chair in this corner, but then the view from it. So like here's just like apartments, but right there's the parking lot. And I was like, I don't want to like sit in my chair and stare at the parking lot. So I moved it here because I'm like, oh, I can just use this door. But now, I mean, the cushions aren't in it, but like when you look at it, it looks less cute because it looks cuter over there. So I think I'm going to move it back <laughs> because like the, yeah, I feel like it just looks way cuter. And I don't know, I need to sit down in it and see like if the view is really that bad of the parking lot. I don't know why it was just annoying me last night that it was like facing the parking lot see okay it looks way cuter this way especially once i put the cushions in they're right there because i'm going to scotch guard them but once i put the cushions in it will look way cuter so and i'll show you when i sit down you don't really see the parking lot so i think it's fine and if i was sitting here and for some reason it was really bothering me i could like you saw how easy it was to move the chair so I think I'm gonna leave it here. I just need to get like a little table. I did the same thing with the Scotch Guard. I like sprayed a corner and I'm just gonna wait a couple hours to make sure that it doesn't discolor anything. And then I'll spray those because they'll be, you know, outside, which there is a screen, which is perfect because bugs, I live in Florida, but uh, I'm so excited. Right there, I just have like my beach chair and my beach umbrella. I have to find somewhere to put those. But I had them out here, so I just moved them out there once I built that. But look at me. I'm building furniture, carrying TV stands from Ikea. What can't I do, really? Guys, there's a little lizard, but he's inside, right? Is he inside or no? Is he in the glass? I can't. I feel. Yeah, he's for sure inside. Frick. I'm gonna like grab a bowl and like remove him. Please don't freak out. I'm here to help you. How is this man inside my house? Oh, I need like a bowl, not a cup. Frick, don't move. Ah! Frick, oh, there he is. I'm trying to save you, bro. Oh, did I just kill him? Oh, I killed him. That was an accident. I'm so sorry. Oh, I killed him. I really didn't mean to. Damn. Well, that's depressing. I freaking killed him. I really did not mean to. I literally pushed down with a paper bowl and it split his body in half. 
Jeez, I didn't know they were that sensitive. I feel bad. I would never, I would never kill one on purpose. Like, that was truly an accident. Okay, I put the cushions on it. It looks so good. I love it. I think it looks so cute. And this is what I meant about facing it this way because, like, even when this is closed, like, it just looks way cuter versus when it was right there, it didn't look as cute because it was just the back of it. But uh, I love it. It's so big, too. Let me show you. See, there's like, I guess you, I mean, you could fit two people if you were like squeezing, but otherwise it's just like super comfortable and you can like lean back. Uh, I love it. This package just came and it is my statement chair that's gonna go over there. It looks really short. I wonder if it's in two pieces. Okay, I guess it is a pretty small chair. Like, it's pretty short. Um, oh wait, does it have feet? I swore it had feet. Like, wasn't just on the ground, but maybe it is. You see, you know what I'm saying? Okay, it does. It's definitely, it's definitely supposed to have feet. Are they somewhere? I just didn't see them. It's like, is it in here? Or there's a zipper at the bottom. There's a hidden compartment underneath. That is so bizarre. Okay, let's see what it says. It doesn't really say anything, but there's instructions in here. How was I supposed to know to look under the chair? That is my new secret hiding place. Maybe I shouldn't even tell you guys it was down there. That's like the best hiding spot. Oh my God. What time is it? I have an appointment. Okay. I probably have to leave before I can put this together. Oh my God, cute. Wait, it actually looks so cute with the feet. I am gonna put it in this corner. I have a rug over there that's gonna go where that uh, blue square is, but I have to go to my appointment, so I will show you when I get back. Wow, I love it. It's like a pop of color because my couch is white, which I'm gonna get, I have to figure out like if I'm gonna get prints or like what I'm gonna do here, but I know they're very different vibes, but I feel, I just feel like it's going to work. This corner is going to be kind of crazy. It's going to be kind of funky. But then I'll bring some funky over here. Maybe like a funky rug. I don't know. I'm kind of like going a little bit outside of my comfort zone. I don't know. Okay, I'm back. And I think before I set the chair up, I need to put the rug out. Because the rug... Oh, I hope I like it. I really hope I like it. Okay, here we go. I'm going to put you down and I'm going to take off all my my blue tape okay here we go this is the big reveal Okay, I hope I like it. I can't tell if it looks like Polly Pocket or if it looks cute. I feel like it's kind of cute. Let's see. Okay. I feel like it's kind of small. Damn, I feel like it's kind of small. Maybe it should have been bigger. I can't tell. Does it look way too small? I mean, I can't tell. Well, no, it's probably good. 
I can't tell if I like it. Frick, I can't tell. Well, I feel like once I get the other stuff, it'll all come together. Okay, now let's move this and we can put the chair out. Maybe I can even hang up the mirror today. Actually, I feel like that's a good size. Any bigger, it would be way too big. Okay, next is the chair. direction I'm gonna put the chair but okay wait it's kind of cute I feel like it looks kind of cute should I put the mirror up maybe I'll open up the mirror I think it might be cute. Wait, is it cute or is it not? I can't tell. I think it might be cute. I've never had a big mirror like this. I'm very excited. I don't know if I can just lean it against the wall like that or if that's like a really bad idea. I'll probably call my mom. <laughs> I have FaceTimed my mom like every day for the past week because I'm like showing her stuff. But, oh my God, wait. I think it's actually really cute. Wait, there's one more thing. That box is a print. I'm gonna open that up. It just goes with the theme. It's like pink, yellow, and orange. My idea is that it would go on this wall, like this. Abstract art, I'm so mature. I have a beautiful, I'm so excited for the print that's gonna go on this wall. It's not here yet. I think it comes in a couple days. But I am a little bit annoyed, like this frame. I feel like it could be a lot nicer. Maybe it'll wipe off. Let me try to wipe it off. I'm a little bit annoyed about that frame. I didn't know what type of frame to order. They had a they had two different white options. And I didn't know which one to get. Cuz I've ordered from there, but I had black frame. So. 